Penny Sequeiros joins us today uh, after Emory's 1-0 setback to Maryville in the opening round. Uh, Coach, just kind of thoughts on today? Yeah, first of all, uh, you know, my hat's off to Maryville. I think, uh, you know, they did a really good job of getting ready. I think their pitcher did a great job. Their defense did a super job. They made the plays when they needed to. Uh, Jack's, our pitcher, threw, Jacqueline Spazizen threw phenomenally. Uh, we should not have put her in the position that we did because she worked really, really hard. I think she struck out the first 10 or 11 batters in the game. And, you know, you, you just can't expect a pitcher to do what she does um, day in and day out. And offensively speaking, um, I'm going to just be very honest with you. Uh, you know, we had, a, you know, too many individuals that were, were swinging for themselves and they weren't swinging for the team. And, Anytime you're, you know, part of the group, you know, offensively, when you step in the batter's box, um, it, you know, basically when you swing the bat, you got to be thinking, what can I do for the pitcher? What can I do for the person that just got on base? And, uh, you know, based on my my vision and kind of like outside looking in, we were just too much, too independently swinging. And I think if we can kind of connect. Um, ourselves to one another the way that I believe that we can and kind of feed off of good things that happen then those outcomes can be very different um, so you know moving forward we just we really got to kind of reorient our mindset and think about what can I do for her what can I do for her versus can I do it can I do it and I think that once our mindsets kind of reorienting themselves uh, I think we have a much better opportunity of you know having hard touches um, also uh, offensively, we were just we were lifting too much. We were, you know, they, Maryville, to their credit, they were playing back. Uh, we had a lot of hot shots, but you know, when the defense is playing so far, far back, you got to shorten up and hit line drives and ground balls. Mm -hmm. So I don't think our our uh, I don't think we adjusted in the box to make the necessary improvements to put the ball in play in a different way. So we kind of went into it going, you know, same thing, same outcome, rather than uh, different approach, different outcome. So those are things that we need to work on. So good thing is, is we're not done. Uh, tomorrow's a new day. We need to get some rest, stay hydrated. And, uh, you know, our goal is obviously not to be two and done. Our goal is to, to play two games tomorrow, maybe more. So um, I'm looking forward to us putting some adjustments into play. And, um, you know, that's about it. Thoughts on uh, Lynchburg? I'm not sure how much you were able to see that first game. You know, they're uh, they're kind of they come off a, a yeah, tough loss today too. I, I never count Lynchburg out ever, ever, ever. Don does a great job with them. They've lost games before pretty intensely and then turned around and come back stronger. So I'm really looking forward to the opportunity to play tomorrow. Um, it's a new chance, a new shot. Lynchburg's going to be tough, and you know hopefully will be tough as well. All right, Coach. Well, thanks a lot, and we will see you tomorrow. Okay. Thanks, John.